almost at the restaurant about to surprise my mom with this gift um, that I'll show you all once um, I surprise her. Just pulled, um, I don't know if you can see, a shot of espresso or a couple shots with my Keurig. What I did, um, well, before I do that, I'm going to put a cup of Almond Breeze Almond Milk, 30 calories per cup, in the microwave. Because I'm going to make like a uh, at-home latte. I haven't ever done this before, but hopefully it turns out all right so we're gonna put that in for a minute 30 or whenever it gets hot i have this starbucks ground espresso roast um i'm gonna i went ahead and already put all that this is already a used curate cup but i got these refillable curate cups from amazon they work pretty well and what you do is you open it like that and put your grounds after you're done using it, you just simply empty it out in the trash and then rinse it out. Saves money and you can put whatever coffee you want in there. Um, but this is what I got if you're um, curious. And it works with my newer Keurig. So I love it and I'll show you guys after this is done microwaving what happens next. There it is, pretty hot. Sorry, I saw dirty pans from last night's dinner. Um, then this light on. Oh, it's hard to see, but there's the espresso. Gonna go ahead and pour this hot milk in. I might have too much milk. Oh, actually, it might be the perfect amount. So there we go. And there is your at home latte. Um, if you're curious, I filled up the curry cup with the ground espresso and put it on like six ounces and put it on strong mode so that's what I did I'm gonna mix this up and put some sugar in it and tell you how it goes I mean if this works out and tastes good I might do this every morning just taste better I guess I'm gonna put in three splendid packets and see how it tastes and then I'll give you guys a review the review is it's excellent and I might start doing this more often so that is how you make a at home latte with your Keurig. By the way since espresso is zero calories essentially all you're getting is 30 calories in this whole drink 2.5 fat, 1 carb, 1 protein. And if you want to live it up you can go ahead and buy some kind of sugar free syrup so like they come in like all kinds of flavors vanilla white chocolate whatever you just put a few um a little bit in at a time make sure of the taste and some have calories in it but like maybe a carb per serving but yeah that is what we're doing right now it is six in the morning gonna get ready to leave all right you guys off work in record time one second i'm gonna turn down these air vents but off work in record time and today what I had for lunch um, was I microwaved a chicken teriyaki bowl, and four ounces of chicken breast, a serving of jasmine rice, and half a serving of teriyaki sauce, the Hawaiian fried kind. And then I went ahead and microwaved a lean cuisine, the deep dish pizza kind, sausage and pepperoni. Had some of that, 
And I also got my flu mist um, done today, so I went ahead and mixed up some orange airborne and put it in some water, let it sit for a minute, and drank that as well. And that was lunch. So right now, got a serving of C4 and this Quest Bar, which I'm probably going to eat either during my workout or after, depending on when I get hungry. So we're gonna do that and head to the gym. I may see you at the gym or I may not, depending on my mood if I wanna record and how many people are at the gym, but we will see you then. Here's the camera I've been looking at, Sony A5000, but probably won't get it for a while. Gotta save up for it if I want it. Cause I see nobody, nobody but you, you, you. I never come through. to be in you so you guys yeah I really want a new camera but me and they made a deal that I need to keep using the camera I have for a little longer before getting a new one so I'm gonna be saving up for a newer camera and I just wanted to say that I need to one of my goals this year is to, to kind of refocus my channel I want to help people um, learn new things and I feel like my most viewed videos is food so I'm gonna look into making more food videos and you will be seeing one pretty soon in less than a week um, and clue is it has to do with has to do deal with my um, hiking adventure I'm gonna be going on I'm gonna take a week of vacation yeah, gonna record you guys some good footage of prepping food for my hiking adventure. So it's gonna be exciting, you guys. So gonna try and post at least monthly food videos. Six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this new crazy mother. Start wearing more pants 
throughout the week instead of shorts. So I think I might go there. I'm gonna fast a little longer. Um, I bet once I get to the mall, I'll get hungry, so I'm gonna save my quest bar till then. So I'll check in with you guys. Waiting, tired of waiting to try this quest bar, so we're gonna try it right now. I'm just gonna open it. All right, I'm driving. This is dangerous. This is what it looks like. So now I'm gonna do a quick taste test. So I definitely can taste the pumpkin flavor, but um, there's also some of that weird um, whey flavor still in there. But I mean good try but it's still not it's not my most favorite quest flavor um chocolate chip and uh peanut butter jellies um up there as well as the peanut butter um chocolate i think flavor those are my top favorites It's just me but I can't stand people today like driving wise people drive all crazy people like in a hurry getting off the highway ram like goodness but just got to the mall and I'm um, gonna show you guys uh, what I find as I shop so see you guys at the mall it's the best part about coming to the mall during the weekday is it's empty, so. I don't understand why there's so many freaking cars driving all crazy, but just got here. Going straight to, I usually when I shop go straight to where I need to go, so Nike and maybe American Eagle. Pants on, don't like it. I kind of like this one though. Small. It's like kind of a legging but looser fit. Just got home, you guys. Heating up some kimchi stew. Essentially gonna eat the same thing I ate yesterday, so gonna heat that up. And also, I'm heating up this pan to make a couple eggs. I'll show you guys the end result. All right, same as yesterday. Essentially, got a serving of jasmine rice, two whole eggs. Um, I didn't cook the yolk all the way, and 3.3 ounces of chicken thigh with the Hawaiian Pride um, teriyaki sauce. I put half a serving, and then some kimchi soup, tofu in there and seaweed so that is dinner enjoying friends and finishing off my macros you guys i'm gonna have one serving of these cheetos these oven baked flame and hot cheetos pretty good macros um 28 grams of these 130 uh, calories five fat 20 carbs two protein so my ending uh, macros for the day is 189 carb, 56 fat, 105 protein. It's about 16 something calories. 1649. Right there. So, yep. 